Now, uh, the first question, uh, or there are a number of questions that have come with regards to the signs of Laylatul Qadr. The signs which indicate the occurrence of Laylatul Qadr. There are some things which are mentioned in the Sunnah, and there are some signs which people mention which we don't know anything, any uh, evidence for. So the, there is a, uh, the Shaykh is, uh, has been asked to explain some of these signs. Father Shaykh, Anna. Uh, so the Shaykh said in response to this question <coughs> that the signs which indicate Laylatul Qadr and which have been mentioned by the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam I can recall at this moment the following first of them or number one is that Laylatul Qadr is a peaceful tranquil quiet night within that night in the night of Laylatul Qadr you do not hear the barking of dogs or the sound of the cockerel the second sign is that in Laylatul Qadr the people experience a pleasant breeze or a pleasant wind which they enjoy or which they like thirdly uh, in Laylatul Qadr there is rain this is one of the signs of Laylatul Qadr that during the night of Laylatul Qadr the rain falls and fourthly is that uh, when the sun rises on the following morning the disk of the sun is seen without any strong rays or without any rays the disk is a clear disk uh, when it rises in the morning the Sheikh said many of these signs we notice that people they notice them or they see them and if we notice these signs then we should have good uh, glad tidings uh, in the hope that we have coincided with Laylatul Qadr